Hey everybody, I'm here to do a review of Frostwire 5.0.8. Alright, so it has a new icon. Um, let's see if I can focus on that. Let's see if I can focus on the icon. Alright, so it has a new icon. So, and the main thing that I've seen with this new update is how quick it is. It's closed all the way right now. As you can see, I'll go to the system tray. It's not open. Alright, let's go open it up. Watch how fast it loads. Um, it's faster than any other Frostwire I've ever seen. Boom, it's open, and it, you can fully search. Like, it's like totally open, and it's already at turbocharged connection. It loads that quick. Alright, so some of the new features I'm seeing is, let's search for a file. Um, let's just search... Dead Prez, because that's a, a type of dub, dub stuff that I've been looking at lately. Look how quick it is. Alright, and now as you see, there's some new things on the side. Now it shows you, you see the source, and it's from all torrents and everything. It shows you when it was created. So you can look at that. Um, so let's say you want to, let's click on the download. There it is, initializing. And it opens up a link. And it shows you the torrent. Alright. And now it's downloading. So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, and the last option I want to show you really quick is check this out. So I'm going to cancel this download. Um, check this out. When you, you never how it used to be annoying how you would, whenever like you were in Frostwire and you, you X'd out of it, it would stay open. Well, watch now when you click X, you can have the options for it to fully close. Boom. And now it's closed. And then again, let me show you real quick how fast it opens. It's actually remarkably quick for Frostwire. I think it's, I'm really impressed. Boom. So, yeah, guys, there we go. Frostwire 5.0.8. Peace.